hey guys welcome to today's tutorial it's nice seeing you guys today okay actually i'm not seeing you but it's nice knowing that you're watching me right now and this, if this is your first time please thank you for clicking okay today we'll be talking on how to make the spirit fascinator i have with me my strawberry the pedicure set they already made hard um, the scissors and um, the lace fabric so now i'll be picking out the two i'll be using to cut the straw brim and aside from that before that we'll also have to trim out the um the lace fabric so it can actually help us beautify our brim so that is what i'm actually going to be showing you how to do but basically i just told you cut out the design part and this is what you get yes so when you're done with this take out the measurement so you know how much that would contain or that would take how much space space it to contain on your brim then you can now get to do what you would like on the brim but if you still want to know how i did it keep watching and thank you for clicking welcome to face millinery if this is your first time and i would like you to subscribe press also the notification bell beside it so you get notified anytime we upload videos so i've taken the measurement of the lace fabric it's giving me that's giving me six inches so i'll also be checking my brim if it has six inches space for me to place the brim okay you can see we have it and um i've decided to just limit the circle i'll be cutting off from the brim but unfortunately it's too small for my little crown so i'm still going to be expanding the space okay see now at this point you can see that our little crown it's a bit bigger than the circle we created so now we have to be cutting the exact shape if you'd want but for me i took out some of the straws and um, at this point it could fit in to the crown so that's just it and be rest assured that this part of the brim or this part of the brim we've just cut out will still be useful so please don't dispose it yeah so now and uh, you can see we can now fix our brim to the crown yes let's call it a crown yes it's a fascinator cap but at this point it's a crown so and um for the fact that it's a bit tight it can enable us to tweet the brim and make it look uh, a bit fashionable you understand so aside from all this the next is just to attach the lace fabric on this brim and make it um, look more beautiful yes the color is poppy is popping but with the lace fabric it will be more beautiful so that's just it why we watch it and you can see i'll actually be sewing through and aside from sewing i'll also be gluing so to make sure that the lace fabric is well secured on the brim and um it gives a perfect look so please keep watching and uh So what I actually did here was to tack, the first stitching was to tack the lace fabric to the brim and after which I give a little stitch on the lace fabric, gather it a little bit then tack it again to the brim and that was what I did to actually sew round the inner circle of the straw fabric, I mean the straw material and um, before then in order to avoid any silly mistakes i had to actually glue the fabric first to the straw then um, start stitching so this actually helped me to get the exact 
way of placing the fabric to the strawberry. Okay, so at this point we are done with the um, the brim, and it's now time for us to fix the brim to the little crown. And um, if you can see what I'm actually doing at this point.
okay guys you can see now we are done with the trimming and now I'll be cutting out the little flowers on the the lace fabric so I can actually use it to cover up the crown and uh, this minute I've all done that I've done that if it's not much if it's not enough we can as well go back to the lace fabric and cut out some more uh, flowers so now I'll be gluing all those flowers to the crown to make it look like uh, the lace started from the crown to spread out to the brim so that's just the effect of it and um, it actually came out very beautiful so stay with us while we do that and there's still more to learn thank you Wow, look at this beautiful fascinator. Oh, look at this beautiful hat. Yes, the hat is already looking very beautiful. So, this meaning to be attaching our millinery wire. Yes, millinery wire. You heard me right. Yes, actually, we are going to be attaching a millinery wire to the straw brim, and uh, this will help us to form the nice shape we got to form our pirate hat. Yes, and um, I'll be gluing the millinery wire to the brim. Yes, the easy way. I beg. So, as child, you can also stitch at this point. Yes, and um will have something else to share with you and uh when you are done with that you can start forming your lovely brim curves and um however you want the fascinator to sit you can as well use it to make a turn up fascinator or a turn up heart yes basically when your mineral wire is strong is not too strong it gives you a lot of beautiful shapes for your heart so Aside from that, when you are done gluing, you can see where I'm test running the heart of my head. Yes, so so this means you can just form the nice shapes you want your heart to look and um, do some other finishing touches. Yeah, you can see what I'm actually doing here. I'm already forming some curves, but now the millinery wires are looking naked and they need to be clothed so we have to cover them right <laughs> so that's just it when you're done covering clean up your fascinator or your heart cover with petroleum material wherever you feel you should cover but i'll also be showing you how i did mine and how i'll be attaching my alice band so please keep watching and yeah, if you are still here thank you and uh, if this is your first time of clicking thank you and welcome to first family would like you guys to subscribe like and share and also click on the notification bell right beside the subscribe button so you get notified notified any time we upload so there welcome and welcome and i'm also shouting out to our old time subscribers love you guys if you have other questions you would like to ask please drop them at the comment down below let's interact so as you can see how i'm actually gluing to cover the millinery wire you can also use a uh, bias if you don't have a pitash um, i mean you can also use bias yes if you don't have an extra straw to cover 
you can just get creative at this point and uh, there are a lot of materials you can use to cover all right so now it's time to form the shape yes you can see now we've start bending basically just locate where your center will be and where you want your heart how you want your heart to sit before you start bending or curving so whichever one that works for you you go with it so that is just the idea of this fascinator and um Every step you take, you actually test run to imagine how you, it will actually look on your client's head. Or if you are going to be the one to use it, to imagine how beautiful you are going to look on the day you'll be launching your beautiful hat and fascinator. So that is just it. You can see this one is already so beautiful. And I know most of you are already like, oh, I wish I have this. But you can do that. You can do it if you put your mind into it. And I hope, guys, you guys can watch actually do this and send me video clips or actually maybe pictures of your work and um i'm happy when i see things like that and uh, please if you are yet to subscribe because i've noticed that even the people watching the um, unsubscribe people that are watching are way more than the subscribe people so guys if you want me to beg I would beg go but that is just what you give me it's not like you're paying for subscription no subscription is free the reason for just subscribing is to add up to the number of our family and um, you know the face family or the face gang or the face troop whichever one you want it to be like so that is just it it's free to subscribe I would like you guys to subscribe and you know let this family look bigger and uh, that's the only favor I ask of you guys get gi giving you this um making sure this tutorial video reaches you or you have access to this tutorial video this is just the only favor you can do for me to just subscribe and um, like and share thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you in our next video love you